Hello there, this is Rom Wills coming back at you with yet another video. Superficial women don't deserve you. They don't deserve you. Cause you know what, I've been checking out, you know, some of this stuff, like the big thing now is these balloon pops, um, like uh, shows and stuff. And you know, men come in, women pop their balloon right away. And it's always off of something superficial. It's always, always, always some superficial joint and everything. I'm gonna tell you what, I can understand if a guy is just looking dirty, right? And of course, I always tell you, let the barber bless you, you know, dress well, have a good style and everything. But it'd be the women not liking just your style or like something you wearing or they, they making some superficial, uh, uh, judgment just based it, it'd, be, it'd be a thousand little things but it's something that's changeable see the reason like like I said if a woman is rejecting you because you just looking dirty I can be like okay but she rejects you off of some small thing you know you're like hold up hold up hold up honey alright like if the shoes are worn or got scratch on them because like I said women suck your dick off your shoes in fact, real quick on that, so I saw some clip, it was uh, some metaphysicians talking, they were talking about the deepness of shoes. I was like, man, <laughs> some people need to hear that who disagree with that, some men need to hear that. But anyway, I digress. Anyway, I'm gonna tell you what though, they don't deserve you. Cause this is something I've told women. I said, look, why don't you get to know that guy? Why don't you get to know him? I say that in a pamphlet, that really got me started in the relationship thing, finding a good man. It was only, it was really just a long essay, really. Thing was 11 pages, 12, just so, you know, had the right count to print it. But, and then one of the things I said is, I said, get to know the guy. Because a lot of women are missing out on a good man because they ain't getting to know him or they're rejecting the guy for something extremely superficial. Extremely, like all these balloon pop things, a dude could come in wearing something different. Okay, he wearing no shoes. That's not his only pair of shoes or everything. And then they, I mean, and, or you know, where they from or something. It's like some say, like, hold up, hold up. What that got to do with him? You know, why don't you talk with him? I, I t I've told women that. I've told women that. But if you get a woman who's rejecting you off of something very superficial, and I ain't talking about like they just not attracted to you. Sometimes they just not, but it's usually like their, your clothing or something you wearing, or they just don't happen to like it. It's like, okay. Or they might want some guy to say, well, I want you to be more suited. Okay, well, fine. What about when I'm active? I ain't gonna wear the same, nobody wears the same clothes all the time. You know, and I, it's, this is just in general. Like if you, if a woman say she don't want to deal with you, it's like, you haven't talked with me, you don't know me. You don't know me. And yeah, it works, and I'm gonna tell you what. And that's some old school player thing. Uh, who talked about that? Donald, Donald Goins in his monumental book, Finding Good Pussy. He said, you know, women looking for that guy who's riding fine, dressing fine, all the superficial stuff, but they really don't know anything about him. You know, just because he's pushing that Mercedes or late model car, that Porsche or whatever, don't mean he a good guy. Like if you get a woman rejecting you off of those things, you already know. If she show any type of superficiality, you already know. She don't deserve you. She, like, this is something I've told women and, you know, I've told, I've told women this. I said, look, you got to look at that man's character. You got to see what's up. He can change his clothes. Hell, you can go shopping with him. That's no biggie. He can change his clothes. He can change his haircut. You better see what his character's like. Seriously. As much as I promote, get, you know, you still want to fix up as best as possible. But, you know, when a woman's rejecting you, you know, off of, off of that, she ain't, she ain't heard your voice, anything. Boom. And she'll say, and see what kills me. And I've seen this on the balloon shows. They'd be like, well, you handsome, which, which I always say, just being handsome ain't going to get women no matter what. 
but they looking at other things, but it's like some small shit. I'm like, hold up, why don't y'all listen to this guy talk? Now I do give it to like the balloon poppers or any woman who at least will say, well, hold up, let me get to know the woman. They actually give them a pass, but you get some, they be like, well, he wearing this, he got this, so he this. It's like, hold up, hold up, you don't know him. You don't know him and everything. And before some women come on here and say, men do the same thing, uh, baby girl, baby girl, stop. Because I've told men on this channel, get to know the woman too. Find out what's up with her. Yeah, you, yeah, we like them fine, but find out if her head is right. I've said that several times. Any man who's been following me a long time can tell you. So baby girl, don't come on here with that, all right? Don't come on here with that mess. And don't be superficial. Because seriously, they don't deserve you. If you're a man, look. First of all, if you're following me, especially you're a man, you're working on your sovereignty. You're working to get to a certain place in life. You know, you ain't going to dress to follow the crowd. Like I had this woman, I remember, and this, this, was, this was one before, uh, before uh, like it was a big thing with uh, social media and sharing your pictures and stuff. Right, kind of met this woman through this phone thing. Now we had a great conversation, all of that, but then she was like, "Well, you got tattoos and earrings." I said, "No, my ears ain't pierced. I don't have tattoos." All of a sudden, she didn't want to talk with me. I'm like, "Well, hold up, hold up." Everything was cool before that, but I don't have a couple superficial things because I always say my tattoos are my scars, and I ain't, you know, I'm just not gonna pierce my ears, you know. But she worried about that superficial thing, even though we had a conversation. I was like, oh, okay, you worry about those small things, but me and you were able to talk and everything. In fact, you were telling some other women about me, you know? That I could be if she knew what I looked like and was like, nah, you know? But, and I found out she had some girls who told her. So they went, you know, who saw me in person. So, but that was, she was on some superficial shit. Understand something, as a man, you building something. You building something. And nah, you ain't gonna be fly all the time or wearing, you don't, whatever her style is. You know, you gonna wear, yeah, you just gonna, you gonna fix up as best as possible. Ain't nothing wrong with that. You gonna keep yourself clean. But if you get a woman who's rejecting you, oh, she don't like your watch. We can change his watch. You can change your shoes. Can you change it? I would tell the women, can that man change his character? You know? Because like I said, that's why a lot of, uh, that's why a lot of women get burned. They go for that, they, they going for the surface thing, but they're not seeing the substance, you know? But if you encounter that type of woman, you got substance, but she ain't going to try to dig to find it, rejecting you off with some little shit that's easily changed. Like everything, even like right now, I had a, had a beer a few weeks ago at the shaving and stuff for this project and everything. Now, if they lay in the beer game, the shit will grow back, you know? But, you know, and there's a lot of women that lose out on a good man for that reason. But they don't deserve you. If you're a good man, you got substance and everything, don't worry about that woman, all right? Seriously, if she on some like, Little petty stuff like that, you know what? You already know. In fact, I'm gonna get in more into that uh, next episode. If she reject you, bye. So anyway, that's all I have for now. I'll get back with y'all. Peace.